bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. And now the night everyone in the football world has been longing for. Millions will be watching around the world. It is, of course, the biggest final in club football, the UEFA Champions League final. Welcome to the commentary box. Derek Ray here, joined by Stuart Robson. It's Real Madrid versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, we've got some of the world's top players out there tonight, so this has to be a great game, doesn't it? I just hope we see both sides play to their full potential. I can't wait for this. Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside David Alaba in central defence. Luka Modric plays with Toni Kroos in the centre of midfield. And beginning the game up front today, Karim Benzema. Manchester United. David De Gea begins in goal. Harry Maguire plays alongside Luke Shaw as fullbacks. Casemiro plays alongside Fred in the centre of midfield. And the centrepiece of the attack is Marcus Rashford. And now the Champions League final commences. Modric unable to hang on to the ball. Rashford. Benzema. He did look on for them, but not to be. Attacking possibilities for Real, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. No difficulties encountered by De Gea. Marcus Rashford. And he was in the right place to intercept. The referee has given the advantage to Real Madrid. Vinicius Junior. Karim Benzema, who's played at such a high level in an attacking sense for so long. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him here? I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best. He glides past defenders, he's got that ability to run with the ball into open space, he can pick out a pass, he can wriggle out of tight situations. He's the most creative player on the field today. Marcus Rashford. It's going to be United's free kick. And he's going to go back and issue a caution here. Well, the referee wasn't going to forget that, was he? It comes to nothing in the end. Vinicius Junior. It might be the moment to get them ahead. Oh, and the decision is penalty. A big chance for them to take the lead here. Well, there might have been a case for a yellow card, but the referee didn't see it that way. Well, Derek, it's a foul, yes. A penalty, absolutely. But for me, it's not a yellow card. The ref has got that right.
Can he make it 1-0? And he finds the net. No difficulties in counter. Here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. So back in action. And it's up to United now to be inventive. Benzema. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Real did well to regain control of the ball could cross it in here will he find the net and a goal I'll tell you what they're going to be very hard to catch now name on the trophy maybe well it's great awareness of space in the box and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish that's a clever goal He's got past his man. Chances on. And keeping it out. Let's see about the delivery. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. And this to reduce the deficit. And the spot kick is converted as coolly as you like. Well, here it is again, and it can be a risky penalty. He hits it straight down the middle, the goalkeeper goes one way, the ball goes through the middle. Excellent finish. So on with the match, 2-1 is the scoreline, what's going to happen next? And space to attack. Firing it towards goal, could be! Oh, that is a majestic goal! Falling home with precision and style, superbly done! Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. Now the action continues. And no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Jadon Sancho. Useful looking position, you've got to say. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, Real Madrid have certainly dominated the ball, as you can see. And that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Possession one. Karim Benzema. Well, possibilities in the centre. Slipshod passing. Eder Militao. 
spot on with that tackle. Well, the half-time interval fast approaching, and it's so far so good for Real Madrid, certainly. Stuart, your assessment? Yes, it's been a really energetic display from them so far. The passing's been sharp, the movement from the front players has been excellent, and the finishing has been clinical. They will certainly be happy going in at half-time. Well, based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. That is that for the first half here. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Benzema. Can he do it? Promising attack, but his timing was off. Anthony. And well, he could really get at the opposition. Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. Federico Valverde. Look at Modric. Real chance. And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep him quiet. Just look at his movement, he knows exactly how to find space, and it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. So on they go again, and every indication that Real are going to stroll to victory here. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Valverde and support available Modric a glorious chance oh that's a fine save racing forward trying to catch them out Rashford Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Shaw, there to win it back. Rashford, well, tremendous block. The referee has given the advantage to Real Madrid. Benzema. And he takes on the shot. And a fine stop. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Vinicius, determined defending. Advantage, Manchester United. Fernandes. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Karim Benzema. Vinicius, 
and diving to thwart it. Corner kick delivery from Tony Kors. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. of goals, 5-1 it is. There's 20 minutes remaining now. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. Well, trying his luck from a long way out, but the keeper saw it all the way. Ends him up. Goes in the middle. Well, threat over for now. Course and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Needs to clear it away. In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. will switch things around personnel-wise. Cross with the corner. Danger here as he runs at them. It's going to be United's free kick. Well, he can consider himself admonished even in the absence of a yellow card. Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. Valverde and space for them here on the flank in position now oh that's textbook goalkeeping let's see about the delivery Deserves another look. It's a really well rehearsed set play routine. The delivery is inch perfect, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal! Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Benzema. This is Kroos. Being egged on by the crowd. In with a chance. And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. A 
And now the delivery. Taking care of business defensively here. Determined block. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Tony Kors. Chances on. And up for grabs off the keeper. Corner given to Real Madrid. Can someone get on the end of this? Alaba. And there it is! Real Madrid, Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Real Madrid. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking 